So good morning guys. Uh, so I might have said, you might have noticed in my, uh, on my page that I said I'm coming to a pretty epic location this week. Well, welcome to Three Cliffs Bay. So Three Cliffs is um, just down the road from Swansea um, and it's part of the, um, the Gower Peninsula. I was supposed to be coming with Mark Thompson, but um, unlucky mate, because you're missing out big style. The sky, I mean, look. And that's, that's sunrise, which is to the left of the, uh, of the Three Cliffs. Um, so I'm hoping that once that sun peaks up a little bit, it's gonna spill some light down onto these cliffs onto these three peaks here, and that it's gonna give me something epic. But in the meantime, I'm gonna take a few shots that way, catch a bit of that color, so I'll be back in a bit. So, never actually been here before, first time, um, and I'm like a kid in a candy store. It's just, I just don't know where to look. It's absolutely epic. And the best thing about this place as well, um, over, I'm not entirely sure where, somewhere around here, there's a castle as well, up on one of the paths. So um, there's, there's so much to shoot here, it's just incredible. And this little river thing that runs down through here as well, these leading lines is just absolutely amazing. So first composition, shooting this way, trying to catch a bit of color in that sky. I mean, it's self-explanatory really, I don't need to tell you anymore. Um, let's see what's, let's turn the camera on first, shall we? See what we got. So there's the shot. Like I said, nothing special. Nice bit of colour in the sky. Some awesome cliffs. Quite a long shutter speed because um, I've got the polarizer on, and um, and the light is obviously still quite low. So probably getting five or six seconds. Let's have a look. So I'm shooting at f16, and. Yeah, eight seconds, in fact, so nice. Yeah, it's looking good. I mean, this is, you come in from over this way, park on the road, it's probably a 10 minute walk. Not very, not very far at all. So the shot I actually came for, which th this is what it was all about for me, is this, and it's working out <laughs> spectacular. The cloud is just absolutely epic. I just really hope, because there is some cloud on the horizon over that way, I'm hoping that's not gonna blot it out, but just, just look, look. Is that just not epic? Different level stuff, different level. I have to put my coat back on in a minute. It's getting a bit, getting a bit chilly now. I mean, just look at that. Let me show you this. Look at that. That river, absolutely superb. It's beautiful. I didn't check the tide times or anything. It's like, I don't really care what the tide's doing. I'm coming anyway. Because, you know, this, this would work regardless of the tide. I don't even know how far it comes in. Like, judging by the black lines on the rocks, it comes right into the to the face of the cliffs, but absolutely stunning. Stunning. So, so pleased I came. Because I, I almost didn't, because, because Mark had to pull out for, you know, whatever reason. Um, I was a bit wary about coming here on my own because, you know, first time at a, at a location, walking it in the dark, you know, it can be a bit dodgy, can't it? But yeah, I'm so glad I did this. A two hour drive and worth every single second of it without a doubt. If for any reason I had to leave now, or if it started raining, whatever, if the weather turned crap, I really wouldn't care because I've got what I came for. And I don't say that very often, so as you can tell, I'm a little bit pleased.
already, I can see golden light hitting the cliffs in the distance. So fingers crossed this is going to happen. Yeah, so the sun is just starting, as you can probably see behind me, just starting to break up over and already it's lighting up these cliffs here, just on the tops and out into the distance there. And what it should do is just keep coming down and down until it lights up these cliffs here, these, the, the actual three cliffs. And if I can get if I can get that iconic shot, I will be one happy bunny. sun on your back, a gentle breeze, sound of the sea, one more could you ask for? Except maybe a toilet, I could really do with a toilet. All right, I'm done here now. So, sun's fairly high now, so the light's not quite as uh, golden as, as it was, but I'm pretty happy with what I got. Not a bad viewpoint, is it? All right, guys, well, I think I'm gonna wrap it up here because I'm gonna have to trek back to the van now. So, you know, uh, you know where the buttons are. Do what you like. See you next time. She'll take it into her side